What's up guys and welcome to another video and let's get ready to wake up and react to another episode of Jujutsu Kaisen Season 2, Episode 3. Um, Hidden Inventory, Episode 3? I think that they're just calling the whole first arc Hidden Inventory, um, every episode because, um, I guess that's just the name of the arc, so, anyway. Uh, what happened last time? Oh! That's right. Let me pull out my notes. Zainan equals Fushiguro. Call him this or people will riot. That's exactly what I wrote. He's also Megami's dad. <laughs> Sorry, I got that wrong, guys. Jesus Christ. I mean, it, just some of you were, were polite about it, but, and I appreciate that. Love you. But, oh, I heard that's old. That's out, so it's this now. Anyway, but some of you were so mean, like, so toxic. Like, yeah, no. Um, oh yeah, yeah. Oh, this too. I wrote this down too. Um, Six Eyes is the special, um, curse technique that, uh, Gojo can use that people, uh, other, well, yeah, other people in his clan can't. So, the Limitless technique is, I guess, common in his clan, like, everyone can use it. Or maybe mostly everyone. But, yeah, this Six Eyes is something that he's created. I'm gonna, did he create it, or is it just a special move that only he can use? I don't know. I don't know if that means he he's the uh, creator of it, but we'll find. I guess I would assume so. Um, is there anything else that I wrote down that need that I need to, like, bring up? No. Nope. Okay. So, at the end, he was defeating this guy who can, like, um, transfer his real body to, to like, mm, switch places with them, maybe? And, but, he captured, um, uh, what's her name? Amanai Rico. Uh, her maid, Kuroi, he, ca he uh, captured her. And so then I would assume that Geto lost, because he was with her. But then I think was it that he got a call at the end, and it was like that they were captured? I think so. I could be wrong. Again, my memory is absolutely awful, but um, which is why I, I try to write things down. But then I, I'm like, oh, I gotta write that down, and I forget to a lot of the time. But anyway, um, but yeah, I think that's pretty much everything that needs to be summarized. So yeah, let's jump into it, guys. I love water. Ugh. Oh yeah, so she did text them. But wasn't he with her? So like, that means he failed. Oh. Hmm. Oh, you want to say goodbye? Oh. I love the determination in their eyes. <sighs> know what you're getting yourself in for. Alright. <laughs> what is this? What? <sighs> what the fuck? 
Is this a flashback? What the fuck was that? <laughs> what? That was so weird. Okay. Oh. oh. We breeze past that. Okay. Has good eyes. Ah, oh, the six eyes. Hmm. Yeah, you got that right. Oh, no. He looks so different. Oh. Who is that? I guess I should write his name. Hi, buddy. Oh, hi, buddy. I don't know if he's even important, but just in case. He looks so different. Nanami looks so different. <laughs> I know it's been a long time. Why is my nose so red? <laughs> They're such kids. It's cute. <laughs> oh. Oh, what, what, what? Aww, he feels for her. <laughs> oh. Are you... Dude, are you sure you're alright? It may be part of the plan, you know, but I think for the most part, he's doing this because he's like, her life ends after this. Oh my god, it's so pretty! Oh, I get reels like this on my Instagram all the time of people walking through the flowers, like those same flowers, the hydrangeas. So fucking pretty. I want to go to Japan so bad. Just sightseeing. Oh. Oh. I love beautiful sights like this. Like, it's making me emotional. Like, when I see something super beautiful, like, just in nature, I just get... I don't know why, but I get... I get emotional. <laughs> it's her last day. It's Fushi Girl. Oh! <laughs> Clearly, you don't remember your own kid's name, and I guess I'm terrible at remembering names too. <laughs> yes, that was a jab. Yes. <laughs> There's something just kind of like otherworldly about you, kid. Oh. Oh. Oh, look how tired he is. Yup, it worked. Mmm. He never slept. Oh. Well, that's not going to be enough. So these what, last three episodes are going to be a fight? 
I guess maybe two and a half. Oh. Okay. Bro, I really thought that was Kuroi. I wasn't about to be pissed. Kuroi! I love the way she said her name the first time. It's like stuck in my head. Oh. Ew. What? Ew. What is that around your neck? Mmm. Mmm, good plan. He's gone. Oh, he's quick, man. Oh, he sh that's his sheath. Oh, that was crazy. So that's kind of like a, a vault for him. Like he just... Like a magical bag, kind of like Mary Poppins, just pull out whatever you need. <laughs> oh. I feel like he's gonna win, or Megami's dad might run away, because, I mean, we know he's alive in the future, so. God, he's so fast, you can't even see him. Fuck. Wow, oh, the visuals. Oh. You're just destroying everything around you so there's nowhere for him to hide. Oh, that's a lot. Oh, oh, my worst nightmare. Bugs and birds. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm not that there are birds here, but I'm just saying those are my two greatest fears. Birds and bugs. Oh, did he just distract you? Oh, <gasps> no. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Right through his throat? <gasps> what the fuck? Oh! Oh my god, Gojo! <gasps> Guys, I'm like frozen right now. The fact that he survives this is insane. You should be dead. I think I'm getting my edge back now. Oh my god! Ew! Oh, it's like he's already dead. But he survives that somehow. No? I'm assuming, but, um, 
You know how there's a lot of you guys saying that this guy, Yeto, like the one you see in the future, isn't him? Maybe it's a curse that looks like him. So, well, no, they can't. Well, yes, yes. I was thinking about something else. That's what I said no to. Um, uh, I was like, so I was thinking, is the person we see in the future, uh, like a curse or something and not the Gojo we know? But I don't think so. I don't feel like that's true. I mean, somehow he's going to heal or someone's going to heal him. I don't know if Shoko's going to find him or what, but, uh, yeah, anyway. You're giving her a choice? Oh. What? Really? You're leaving it up to her? You decided that way before? Wow! <laughs> but he's already dead. Or at the very least very badly injured. He's not in fighting condition. That's so sweet that they gave her that choice. music oh. yeah no that's not girl that's not realistic you human <clears throat> a human I'm sorry she just ruined this emotional moment hang on all right here we go I'm so glad that she's like not going through with this. Watch Tengen's gonna kill her. <gasps> I ex I said it but didn't expect it. Who did it? Who's she girl? That would make sense. Wait, did he want to kill her? So well, I guess kill her so that he can't assimilate. Yeah. I can't believe he just fucking did that. This guy's about to go ape shit. Oh my god. Yeah, why did you do this? Oh wow, double whammy! Mmm, he's pissed, bro. Oh! The guy with the wraps? Gives me that other guy kind of vibes. <gasps> it ends there? Man, it's just me, but I hope that Megami's dad dies. <laughs> He's the worst. He is the fucking worst. Did anyone notice my t-shirt? I'm representing, bro. Okay, anyway. The episode, so... Gojo is probably not dead. Close to death, yes. But maybe Shoko will show up and, like, I don't know, heal him somehow. Um, because he's probably not dead because we see him alive in the future, right? Or if he is dead, somehow he'll come back to life. But, uh, I don't think he's gonna, like, be healed in time to help Geto with his fight. So, Good luck? Like, I don't know. I, I So far, I don't have a good estimate, approximation, whatever word you want to use, or grasp on, like, how powerful he is, at least compared to Gojo. Like, we know Gojo is, like, here. I don't know, like, top tier. I don't know where this guy 
sits. Like, I don't know how he compares. So... And I, 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 uh, I kind of have an idea for Megami's dad. Like, I would say he was probably just below Gojo. I mean, he knows that, like, if he was Gojo was in like peak condition, he wouldn't have been able to defeat him. He admitted that himself. But he outwitted him. At the end of the day, that's what happened. He was outplayed. Fair, fair, dude. But I don't know why he wants. It's like, you want um, Tengen to lose control and for all the defenses to come down on all the schools. So what exactly is, there's probably something hidden in the school that he wants. What is it? I don't know. <sighs> hmm, I don't know what his plan is. I feel so bad for Amanai, like, the girl, like, right when, like, her hope was given back to her, right? Like, just snatched away in an instant. Like, I tried to see the silver lining, right? Well, at least she was semi-happy or, like, hopeful when she died. She didn't see it coming, like, she... <laughs> uh, that's rough, bro. But I, I felt it. It's like when there's that like extended kind of like silence and they're like you're there's like just a a still shot on someone's face. It's like, oh, I feel it. It's coming. Like you can feel it. That or they're like slowly panning out and they're like, you just see them. It's just like, mm, but it's too quiet. You know, it was way too quiet. And that's kind of like my giveaway of like something's about to disturb this silence. Bang! <laughs> oh. You can just feel it. I've never really thought about it before, so that was kind of me just like off the cuff, kind of trying to understand it myself of like why I always feel it coming. Like, I'm not saying I'm the only one, I'm not saying I'm like special or anything. I'm sure a lot of people saw it coming, but I'm just like, yeah, she's about to be shot. She's about to die. I mean, not shot, but like, I knew she was about to be killed. Um,. But I didn't think it was going to be him. I thought it was going to be Tengen. Like, I thought he was going to, like, you know, he was listening maybe and was going to, like, pop out and be like, bang, or whatever. He was, no, not bang, not a gun. He probably wouldn't have a gun, but some sort of curse technique or something. Or just, like, snap her neck or something. I don't know. Damn, dude. That really, mm, that was just really like, I don't know the word to describe it. Maybe, I was going to say like depressing, but yeah, I, I guess that kind of works. I just feel so defeated, you know, like damn. I was already imagining this girl's future, like oh my god, she's going to just live her life as a normal kid. No. <laughs> that sucks. I'm interested to see how this whole thing, this whole mission, and its aftermath, I want to see how it's going to affect them, these characters, moving forward, you know? Because even in the current timeline, you don't really have a proper or really in-depth understanding of Shoko or Gojo or really many of the like older characters I feel like we just scratched the surface with them and I get it probably this whole backstory this arc is supposed to inform our characters but not I, I don't feel like it's done that yet like I yeah I understand what he was like as a kid compared to he's sort of similar now actually Gojo but I think that's just like he masks a lot of the darkness that's going on in here um 
he projects uh kind of like this goofy exterior i don't know but it's not how he i think is feeling on the inside but i i want to know if that's just an assumption you know i'm not sure um but i want to know if like you know after this we get like a heart to heart between our characters or they do actually kind of talk about how this has affected them somewhat you know um because again i still feel like we've only scratched the surface with these characters you know maybe that's just me i wonder how uh the rest of you guys feel about that but anyway uh i don't think i have anything else to add so yeah if i miss anything let me know politely i don't mind being corrected guys it's just all in the way you do it you don't have to be an asshole about it um but you there was something else i wanted to say uh oh and let me know what you guys thought of the episode uh anything else nope okay remember to like share and subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified every time i upload a video and if you guys want full reactions you can catch that on my patreon the link for that's in the description below so please check that out and sign up to support the channel anyway i'm going to get out of here guys and i will catch you in the next reaction